Good. Now, when most comedians come, actors make it to the big time, they buy themselves a big time car. Rowan Atkinson, for instance, bought himself a McLaren F1. Steve Coogan got a Ferrari 355. Norman Wisdom... Well, forget that one. Anyway, our guest tonight, when he made it to the big time, he bought one of these. Are we ready? Right, here we go. Look at that. It is a Vauxhall Cavalier convertible. Plainly, this guy was devoted to making people laugh, even when he was on his way to the supermarket. Shall we meet him? Ladies and gentlemen, Harry Anfield. What in God's name possessed you to buy one of those? It's absolutely lovely car, very reliable motor, the Cavalier. But I did feel like a bit of a, you know, because I'd sort of become slightly famous, and uh, you find yourself, it's the only convertible I've had to go up to the lights in the middle of London, because I've always lived in London, and you're sort of in the lights, and you've got the roof down, and there are people crossing the road in front of you, and they look in, and they see it's you, You, in that oh, loads of money, <laughs> And you're just stuck there because the light's red. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look. Here, there's a magazine, the uh, convertible correspondence for the Vauxhall Cavalier Convertible Owners Club. What a great you were, I know, you, you appeared in this, and this is my favourite bit, in, under famous owners. An occasional feature. <laughs> they haven't been able to find anyone since who's got one, and you said it was, li it was better than a BMW. Did I? Yeah. Well, I think it is. It's better than a BMW. What fine yeah. hair. Yes. Which bit of it did you think was better than a BMW? Then? Well, I think I thought it, the price was better than a BMW. <laughs> Fair point. Probably. Interestingly, um, when you decided that it was time to part mm. with the um, Vauxhall Cavalier convertible, you were getting even more famous at the time. You went backwards and bought a Rover 200. Yes, yes, I did. Again, yes. what in God's name possessed you to do that? <laughs> Because most work in our industry is done in Soho, and there was a shop in Soho that sold rovers. So I went in there and, and bought the rover. Forgive me, Soho, it's close to Park Lane, on yeah. which, from memory, there's Aston Martin, Jaguar, oh. BMW, Lexus, McLaren, and so, right. on, and so forth. Right. You could have gone to any one of those shops, not to the Rover one, and bought a Rover 200, which was... But the on. Rover was in Soho, and they're about half a mile away, and, you know, then... So is no. this why you swapped uh, the Rover for a Metro? Yeah. <laughs> when you were going around to say 